<laughs> this song said I should I'm gonna start off with your mama. She should have whipped your eyes. Somebody could have mommy issues. I can't sleep. It's way past I got the, my alarm goes off in an hour. I tried like two hours worth of going to sleep. It's not working. You might want to look cute. Somebody's admiring you. That wasn't just a coincidence. Okay. Some of you guys. <laughs> I wasn't thinking about nobody. So please. Sometimes I get irritated when people get caught up in me channeling. Doing messages and using my own personal experience. Thinking that the reading is talking about me. Sometimes it could be talking about me. And I'm just in denial. And I'm just focused on the reading that I don't realize it. But most of the time. It's me talking to you guys. It's the only way I could. I could by using personal experience people are like I feel you I understand what you're going through like please stop it I'm using me as ex a fucking example like what is it some people are being feeling like people are okay I don't want to go that deep but I just so for some of you guys because what I'm about to say I don't want nobody to be thinking that this is me and I was up thinking about somebody because I for sure was not I was just trying to go to sleep throw, scrolling through my phone watching different video random and stuff but some of you guys, you may be up at night thinking about somebody. And they usually say when you are up thinking about somebody, it's because they're thinking about you. So that's the reason why I just said my disclaimer. Because I don't want nobody to think that I was up thinking about somebody. Okay? thinking that, I don't know where I'm getting this from. Because <laughs> I be hating my comments sometimes. I be like, oh, you guys are so, so slow. I see why you guys are... <laughs> Gosh, I would just say flip flop the rose don't take it personal and then y'all will be that's not me i'm not that person that was them such and such like well what the fuck i didn't say it and i wrote it in the description bar i didn't wrote it in my bio to flip flop these rows okay i could be saying you it could be them to prevent all of that before y'all even come at me but y'all still <laughs> i'd be like okay <laughs> i see what's going on you motherfuckers don't listen <laughs> you motherfuckers don't listen worth shit. <laughs> but somebody's admiring you. And somebody is admiring you. And. Okay. One of these classic situations where I've been thinking of the future. Money is the root of all evil. Duh. I don't know how to feel about this person or this situation. Because money's on their mind as well, too. So they could be looking at you. But let's keep going. Somebody that admiring you. But you can't sleep because they're up thinking about you. Now, for some of you guys, that wasn't just a coincidence. Thank you, Spirit. Because the card that was right here, someone behind is watching you. I think you, I think you know exactly what's going on. Stop going through their phone. I wouldn't trust it. Then we had right here on the top, it said, put the wand down and go out in the nature. Some of you guys are up the way that you are because this person is trying to come to you in your dream state. They could even be doing like little love spills um i don't even know y'all i was going I don't, I don't really know no love spells how they do it but i just know like actual traveling trying to come to you in your dreams they're doing stuff as far as that um i don't know but somebody's doing something as far as like trying to call you in they want you to have their baby but be mindful though, because this person could have money issues and they're looking for you to have their baby chill as a come up. Like, you know, that attachment. Oh, I'm getting sleepy now? Okay. They feel like they could have a business with you. A baby in the business goes running hand in hand. But I guess they're feeling like this baby is going to help them go into business with you. Usually, I mean, with that, it's like you, you got to take care of a business like you would a child. You have to. Cause you got to take care of that business, right? But somebody feels like if I get a baby by you, I'm going to be able to get a business out of you. Whoever you are, spirits are always around you. This may surprise you. See, I don't like when spirits start because I'm like, what the fuck was that? Anyway, I've been thinking of the future. He'll mess up your pH balance. Time to take care of you. And then the song that's on right now is, Won't you be my girlfriend? In sync. You can't make this shit up. <laughs> Fuck. So there's somebody that's looking at you as a prospect candidate. They want to put a baby in you because they want a business out of you. Mm. 
I don't really like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Optical remover. Optical bait may be getting in the way of what you've been calling in. For some of you guys, I'm so tired of these axes. This is an X that is, okay, I'm saying it's an X. It don't have to be. We'll see exactly what it is, but it's something that's in the way of what you've been trying to call in. Okay. <laughs> Thank God I'm getting sleepy, though. For some of you guys, you may realize every time you get fully focused on yourself, your money, your career, your businesses, then all of a sudden that's when a man or a female wants to come in the picture for you. When you're focusing on yourself and you're not worrying about nobody else and what they got going on. That's when these people want to come in and court you in. Because they see that you're focused. They see that their mind is on the prize. Okay? Your mind is on the prize. Your mind is on the money. Okay. And it's this X. You, some of y'all have an ex that's into heavy fucking spell work. They're into like somebody's an illusionist. They know how to do things to make things look like something that is not through spell work. Whatever spell work they do, they do it well. For example, let me tell y'all something. I ain't even gonna use me, but it could be for it could be something as simple as this person could lie and be like. Oh, they're with somebody or they have somebody. Now, all of a sudden, you may realize you do certain things or you act a certain way, but you're acting and it's, it's, it's betraying yourself as you're unavailable. You got somebody, but you really don't. It's just the spell work that's being done. It's hard to explain. It's like an illusion. Um, you may find yourself always trying to explain yourself or always be like, hold on, no, that's not what it was. Let me try to get it back together. But it seems like somebody is an illusionist. I don't know how to explain it, but that's like spell work. That's dark magic. But somebody does, th whatever type of spell work they do, they, very, they do it very, very well. So on your end, it may look like, I don't even know, something... You may be realizing... Somebody could be realizing certain things, like when it comes to, like, pictures, videos, and things. This is very specific, okay? Like, you may realize, damn, it looked like somebody's on the side of me, but it's not. It could just be, like, a pile of clothes or the way your bed. Say you take a picture in your bed and you post it on Instagram, and somebody could be like, oh, that's somebody on the side of this person, but it's not. It might just be, like, the way your pillows are set up, so it's making it be, like, an illusion as if somebody is right there. Or say, for example, you're recording in your home and, like, they hear, like, a windowsill. Or it just, they just hear something and somebody's, like, suspecting somebody's in there, but it's not. It's just you. Because somebody's an illusion that they did some type of spell work to make something appear as something that is not. I don't know what to say because they know that this person... All these readings are being like this. There's a lot of people that's watching people do spiritual work, reading, divination... They know that people are due for a lot of... I feel... I said us. I'm, I'm including me. Am I including me, spirit? But for anyway, a lot of the collective right now, I feel like people have been knowing that they've been long overdue for a relationship. Closer to me, child. I'm sorry. Lay closer here. Listen, listen to me. I was hoping... <sighs> Some of you guys, it's been a lot of you guys that have been feeling and knowing that you were due for a relationship, wondering where the fuck it was. It was this person with their illusions. Someone could even say something as far as, like, you have this, you got that, you got bugs, you got this and that. You, it, let me just tell y'all something. It's so crazy how they could do the illusions and what they can do. A lot of you guys been under illusion spells. Okay, having you look a certain way because they knew that this person was admiring you. It's an illusion. Can we make up? And I'm trying to tell you, this person wants to make up with you. It's kind of like what I'm getting right now is like after you're done crying over the situation, now they're crying and going crazy and doing spell work. And now you're looking at them like, oh, that's how I look. I look like you trying to keep up this situation 
I was looking like you trying to force you to stay like i'm glad i see how i look because this is scaring me you look a hot mess you're doing too much let me go it's not funny anymore when um the other person is crying and <laughs> now and this person is going over and beyond trying to get your attention for some of you guys this person somebody is also besides that somebody's under the illusion that they have to do spell work to get you and it's throwing some shit like all the way off balance. I'm going to just say that. The energy is becoming haywire. There's for sure some obstacles in this situation. Can we make a... Dreams of abundance. As you sleep, God, your angels, and your higher self are giving you divinely guided ideas, answers, and solutions. Be sure to record your dreams in a journal because they contain valuable insight that will help you manifest your desires into reality. And then we have bountiful nature. This is speaking of getting spending time in nature helps to okay spending time in nature helps shift you to a higher vibration and reminds you of god's infinite abundance go outside and enjoy a walk or a hike with your pet meditate beneath a tree garden sit under the stars or do some other activity to connect with limitless vastness dreams of abundance what i say this person is dreaming of you thinking of you some of you guys, they're trying to come through your dream state. Some of you guys, they was already warned that you and somebody else have some type of telepathic communication. Some of you guys may be realizing, I'm thinking about this person a lot, dreaming of this person, they're dreaming of you. You may not even know it, they're dreaming of you too. You and this person could be having like the same exact fucking dreams. Like y'all are visiting one another, okay? But some of you guys, this is this other person, this little devil, they're trying to interact and come in and stop this connection that you and this person has. This person needs to step back into reality and realize what the fuck is going on. Y'all ain't meant to be. Y'all ain't meant to be. Y'all got somebody playing with your dreams. They're trying to keep you up. It's, why did I put that back? Where did they just go? Damn, why did I put that back? They want you to forget about this person or they don't want you to see this person. Because some, some of you guys, they know your dreams are powerful. They know, and they don't want you to see this person. They don't want you to be aware of knowing who this is. They're trying to keep it concealed. Say yes. All you got to do is say yes. Unlimited ideas. Mm -mm -mm. Your mind is one with God's infinite mind. Therefore, you have complete access to unlimited ideas guaranteed to bring blessings all you need to do is take divinely guided action to allow these ideas to come to fruition some of you guys it's just you yo whatever business you do you might you dream like a motherfucker your dreams are powerful and they know you can see things through dreaming and somebody's trying to keep you up so you won't get your ideas from your dreams but you got unlimited ideas if they try to stop that gift one one other gift is going to fucking in hiding it's kind of like if they try to take your eyesight your smelling is going to fucking enhance so that whatever they're going to do to you you always going to enhance and that's scientifically proven that's scientifically proven People that can't hear, they might have very good eyesight or they can smell very good. Just because one sense is down, one other sense is in high tent. They all they can't they can't stop you. High honor. You somebody that's of high honor. This high honor card been coming out a whole lot. Or this is somebody of high honor. That is, wants you, admiring you, marriage. This person wants to marry you. I don't know who I've been talking to, but y'all got somebody of high honor that wants to fucking marry you. Like, they see what you're worth. They see your worth. I'm hearing there's a lot of people that don't, but this person sees your worth. And all you got to do is say yes. Don't deny what you feel, baby. Undress. Undress you? I don't know what she they just said. I know this song, but when I do the reading, sometimes I can't. I'm about to let you know you make me so, so. 
So this person could be somebody of high honor in their community, in their workplace, of their status, whatever. But somebody is of high honor. You got sudden wealth in reverse. Some of you guys, they're trying to stop you from getting this high honor. They're think they want to stop this sudden. Somebody is due for some sudden wealth. Or this is all due to you, and they trying to stop this shit. That's so fucked up. Somebody's been spiritually attacking you. Somebody been spiritually attacking you. And let me tell y'all something. It could be people that's not realizing they're spiritually attacking you, but they could be doing things to annoy you, to throw you off your path, to throw your concentration off. That's spiritually attacking you. Trying to make you lose hope, make you lose faith. They're trying to make you lose your dignity, your pride, your soul. Trying to make you feel less than of a person that you are. Trying to make you doubt yourself. Like, the fuck? House. Yeah, it's dealing with stability. Relationships. Protection. Damn, somebody is due for it all. Somebody is due for it. Like, somebody is due for a fucking raise, a promotion. Celebrate. Like, you're somebody that's supposed to be, like, honored and praised. And it's like some people or some or person that... They cannot fucking stand your ass. But that's not up to them. Like, this ain't up to them. But somehow they're a, they're they're stopping this. Because they're a fucking false person. Because they're a false person. They're trying to portray themselves as either being you or somebody that you're supposed to be with. Courthouse. Child. Some of you guys, somebody is dealing with a court situation. Somebody's getting dragged. This person likes to drag you back and forth to fucking court. They like to throw you off balance. Like, what the fuck is wrong with this person? Gift, expectation. They could they expected something from you. They're expecting money and shit from you. Some of y'all could be dealing with somebody that had mama issues. I want to start out with your mama. She should have whipped your ass. Boy, you ain't shit. Whatever. I'm trying to be talking so loud. Somebody got mama issues. Mama issues. Now, I don't believe in spanking and giving hitting, but I do. I, I do. I do believe in disciplining. Okay. I'm not gonna say I've never hit my kid ever a day in life. I've had to do a pop. Like sit yourself down, sit your I ain't say so. Sit your ass down. Excuse my language, but sometimes you gotta get that way, especially if you like out in public. And it'd be crazy too when you be feeling some type of way when you out in public and people be looking at you, expecting you to do something. Like, uh, uh-uh. we, you better do something. To, and you have to do something, like you know. But some of you guys, this person acts like a badass fucking kid. They deserve. They feel like they deserve everything. Somebody feels like they need to be taken care of. You, you have to take care of me. Especially if you have a child with this person. Mother, it could be a, a woman or a female. I'm feeling it's a male for a lot of you guys. Some of you guys, they feel like since you had my child, you have to take care of me or you have to give to me. Somebody feels like because you, you kept their child, you wanted them. You wanted your fucking child, not them. Okay, this is where this person has you fucked up at. Somebody feels like you need to love me like your mom, my mom loved me. Some of these people didn't even get love from their mama, so they don't even know what this love is. I'm going to be for real for what you like right now. Some of you guys, like, I would love you like I love my motherfucking child. But even my own kids respect me more than you're respecting me. So I don't got to deal with this shit. You can see your ass to board in fucking school. You're going to have to go somewhere. 30 days in fucking what? Beyond straight, whatever that shit is, somebody needs to get they they act right together because somebody wowing and they they resorting into spell work, male or female. Somebody could be sitting up in the courthouse lying on you as well. Official person in reverse, they're not your official person. Be mindful because I had a baby's father that was this way as well too, like trying to portray themselves as trying to be the you're you're not that thoughts. Great fortune in reverse, they have thoughts of taking your fortune away from you. Somebody's trying to portray themselves as this person that is an official person. They're the right candidate. They've been doing everything possible in the right way to... They don't understand. They don't under, They just don't get it. Um, why you're treating them this way. They're a false person. They are not the official person. 
Someone already sees what you're destined to be and what you're destined to walk into. I'm so tired of talking about this. It just keeps coming out. There is somebody that is sitting up lying. Lying. And they know they lying. They ain't full they ain't they ain't they ain't worth nothing. They ain't worth nothing. They not even worth a sack of potatoes. And we could do a lot with some potatoes. But they not even worth that. Because y'all know potatoes are somewhat cheap in the back. And you can make fries out of it. Smothered potatoes. Um, mashed potatoes. You can do a lot with some potatoes. <laughs> this person ain't worth it. They not worth it. Even the community. The community looking at you like if you were to take this person back. You would be a goddamn motherfucking fool. Courtship in reverse community. Because there's a lot of people that sat back in, behind closed doors. I'm trying to tell you, they didn't sat behind closed doors and they seen the toll and labor that this person has put you through. They didn't seen the stress. Even if they have not spoke up about it, they know you know that they know what's been going on. There's been like some silent shit going on. There's a lot of people, there's a community of people that sees what the fuck is going on. So if you was ever, you will be, I told you already, don't that you will be a fucking fool. A fucking fool. A fucking fool. <laughs> I'm going to say it again one more time. You will be a fucking fool to take this person back. Like, period, point blank. I'm going to wait to do this afterwards. Somebody needs to remove this person out of their fucking life. I don't know how, but somebody, it's shit. Like, they sitting up lying now. Because they know they got to walk away. Ooh, shit. They don't they gotta walk away. Eight of Cups. Somebody it's best that somebody walks away from this situation. There's no love in it. All these cups are spilled over. You walking away because you know it ain't no love. You walked away to go get your nine of cups, your wish for fulfillment. To enjoy the finer things in life. Remember I said to in the beginning, it's always when you worrying about yourself and focusing on yourself, getting your life together and focus on just the finer things in life, enjoying yourself. This is when shit you feel like, wow, where were y'all at when I needed y'all? You're talking about these prospects. Somebody's been sitting up lying like a mother effer. King of Swords in reverse. A lion. This person is a liar and stalking the hell out of you. Plotting on you. Saying a whole lot. These are empty promises. Ain't shit. You lying. You lying. You two lying ass fucking cards. Scheming, scamming. You mother. You liar. And a stalker. Y'all got this. This is a stalker. I hope nobody didn't try to send some, show some info, something about them. Like, somebody could even been trying to show something and it's going to prove that they've been stalking. What's this? Eight of Cups, King, like you, stalker. Four of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. They're trying to hold on to you, although you are independently free on your own, single. They're trying to make it seem like you're not. It's being shown. For some of you guys, this person could even lie and said that you guys are married. It's been coming up a lot, a whole lot. But somebody's trying to hold on to you for finances because they see you are nine of pentacles. Financially independent. You're out here enjoying the fruits of your labor. Nine of pentacles. You done worked hard for something and you enjoying yourself. Buy your lonesome, just you. Some of you guys could be pregnant. You may be pregnant by this person, but you don't want to deal with this person. But they feel like because you are pregnant by them, you have to be with them. But you know the real them. Somebody has mental issues. They're a stalker. They lie about every fucking thing. They feel like you have to take care of them. Especially if you're pregnant. You're supposed to be taking care of me. Somebody could even be like this person with hiding funds and finances from me. If we not married, I can do whatever I want to do. Right? You see clear as day. You got to release this shit. It's becoming burdened. It's becoming burdensome. For some of you guys, I'm strongly hearing this person talk shit about you to something to the right candidate. Somebody sees and wants you. Whoever they've been talking about you to, they actually want you. And they say that I'm crazy, but you know you're not crazy. Oh, somebody in your work. Ooh, so they've been running their mouth to you in the work environment. Somebody like, I know exactly what to do with that, though. You didn't know what to do with it, but I know what to do with it. It was getting kind of messy. But let's keep going with this Eight of Cups, Nine of Swords in reverse, Page of Swords in reverse. 
two of cups. I'm trying to tell you, king of cups. I know what I'm talking about. Somebody said, I know exactly what to do with that, though. This real king of cups coming through and giving you a motherfucking offer of commitment right from the beginning. You might want to look cute, somebody that admiring you. Somebody like, I know exactly what to do with you. you. I see you confused this fucking day. You don't know what to do with that. You don't know what to do with that. Uh-huh. Ace of Wands is a brand new beginning coming to you. Some of you guys going to have to disconnect from your family because your family was helping this fool do the spell work, these lies, the breath, these lies about you. Because for some of you, you came up and it's like you started focusing on yourself. And I guess this family and this ex-lover thought that you were supposed to take care of them. Like, how much money do you have? For some of you guys, these people, with it being reversed, some of these people was under an illusion that you, like, hit the jackpot or you won some shit and you didn't. For some of you guys, you won something and this man stole it from you. I've been talking about a stolen scratcher or a stolen, a stolen lottery ticket a couple of times. A couple of times. Uh, I mean, I did, like, two readings on that shit. For some of you guys, they stole this from you. And they've been lying about this. Some of these people, they already, ooh, okay, anyway. But some of you guys, they were under the impression that you came up on some type of wealth. More wealth than you have. More money than you have. Some of you guys are like, you're you good. You got a little chump change, but I feel like they feel, somebody feels like you are like rolling in dough. Like hundreds and hundreds and thousands, like millions and shit. So that's why they doing, somebody under a false impression, illusionist. Like I didn't say, this man could be talking about, it's some type of illusion going on, okay? And now these people are going to see clear as day. These two of swords in reverse are going to keep coming up. With the higher fan, are you married? Or is this like the government, y'all? Because every time this official person in high honor come up, the higher fan always come up on some of these decks. For some of you guys, again, like I said, this person was lying to in court. Some of you guys, somebody been going through some shit behind closed doors because of this man lying on you to a court system or somebody higher up in the system or organization or institution on you. They could have said you were non-committal, you're not traditional, you don't you don't do things in a structured way. Um you do things that are non-conventional you don't follow the rules you don't follow ranking you don't respect elder you don't respect people above you things of that nature and it, the higher finish upright look at you 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 you're solid but somebody's been like completely trying to fucking fuck you over okay just fuck you over baby uh, the emperor in reverse i know i'm talking about the devil six of cups somebody from your past you strongly could have a child with this person um, my nose is itching like crazy now, too. They're trying to fuck you over so you can be with them, only them. Like, they, they, it's one of them, like, a fucking jock, a fucking dick. Like, a dick probably don't even work, excuse my language. But, like, this is one of them people, like, I want to talk fucked up about you so you can only, nobody else will want you, but only me, and you have to be with me. Like, they're trying to make it so that nobody else can want you, only them. Like, you, you will only want to be with them. Because you have no other option because nobody's going to want you. Who's going to want you? Fucking dick. Or bitch. Excuse my language. We're not gonna go there. They got a lot of connections, as well, too. They know a lot of people. But that's where they fucked up at. <laughs> What's going on? I'm irritated. It's like non-stop, non-stop, non-stop. And this is a side note to myself. Like, I can't. Voodoo. Somebody for sure is doing something. Let go of control issues and honeymoon. So this person needs to let go of control issues. Allow this situation to naturally unfold. Enjoy the bliss of holiday times together. This is what this person is hoping to do with you, child. 
Let me just get one, because I don't get two of these. Unless it's in the beginning. Just give me one. Some of you guys, child, with some of y'all, you deserve to be loved. You are lovable. I know what I'm talking about. This person could be using your child. The holidays is coming up that they need to be with you. You supposed to be with them. Somebody like popping up out of nowhere too. That's that page of swords in reverse. After no speaking, because ain't no com ain't no words being spoken. That lies, false person, high honor, in reverse. I'm sorry, not high honor. False person, official person in reverse, courthouse. Like, you know what this is. House, sudden wealth in reverse. They trying to come through you and take, they trying to play games with you. They trying to use your money. Unrequited love. They trying to use your money to take care of their other folks and people and other relationships that they in before Christmas is coming up. Now, don't be fooled now. What's going on? So this person could even thought because they knew people of certain people in high status that they could continue to keep you isolated from the world through spell work and illusions. Yeah, but it's not working. To recapture romance, allow your inner useful spirit to have fun, a fun to shine. See, somebody needs inner, um, you were trauma bonding with this person. You both may have childhood wounds. Okay, and I feel like that's the running why I'm in hell still. And that could be the reason why you att attracted this person or you got attached to this person. Because y'all was trauma bonding. But now it's time for you to be playful. It's time for you to shake this person off. It's time for you to remove this person off of your path. So you can have fun and you can live life. Because this person is sucking you dry. They're trying to suck you dry of everything. Of love. Of playfulness. Just... Whatever it is that you actually truly deserve. They're trying to make it seem like you don't deserve it. Just so they can be with you. Like that don't even fucking make sense. It's like pimp shit. Somebody, this person probably is a pimp. Okay. Whether they feel like that's their job title or not. They may not even actually say it. Like this is like some pimp shit. Okay. Lonely, Leo, long distance, shopping, they're cheating and creeping at night, stay away, dinner dates, movie, reunion, in reverse. So this person for sure, higher commitment, don't trust it. Like, I okay, spirit knows what's going on here. This person has other people off to the side. They're trying to woo you in and come in, okay, so that they can get some money out of you for the holidays, for the next prospects. Drama, unfinished business. There is some drama. They feel like there is some unfinished business when it comes to you and them. And we have proposal. This person is going to try to fake propose to you knowing that they can't marry you. What kind of shit is this? Something ain't going right. What's going on? The test, try yoga or exercise. This person is careless and they're the devil. Yeah, they're going to try to come in and stress you out to no end, though. They are. And especially if you're going through court cases with this person. Pay attention. Is at the bottom of the deck? Do you? Baby, can you please just stay? It ain't too late to work this thing out. Child... What is going on? What's going on? And somebody new on the scene. They're like, if you take this person back, you better not take this person back. Reach out. Memories. The star. Illusion. Seeing things. Child. Hmm. So if somebody wants you to reach out, they be they gonna be talking about a whole lot of memories from the past. Remember this. Remember that. They all talk. No action. They ain't about shit. You remember that? They're illusionists. They're trying to heal this situation with memories and gander. It's not going. Don't let it fucking work. I mean, look because they are non-committal. You already know what's going on. I just told you. You already know. Open your eyes. Pay attention to your intuition. Continue to pay attention to these dreams. Although they're trying to keep you up at night. 
So you can't think they yeah, playing games and you know you can't be alone with them. I know this could be like a pimp, an angry person that money don't get their way, they like to throw fits and your family was helping this person. Yeah. Hell no, nah. past lovers, stop playing spirit. I know what I'm talking about. Mm. Okay, I love you guys so much. Take care, y'all. You're done with illusionists. Uh, they say don't stop. Okay, well, now look, the anger issues. I, <laughs> it, these cars is crazy. Oh my goodness, they got anger issues. Don't be alone with them. Your ancestors said if I say don't stop, because somebody said no, your aunt, somebody needs to know this. You may be thinking about taking somebody back that is not no good for you. No good for you at all. Especially if you've been going to court cases with this person and they've been lying on you in front of a judge or about a situation. I think it's time we let go. It's been time. What am I holding on to? Blockages, obstacles, dis disturbances. Like, please stop. Judgment. You Heavy protection. You won't be protected if you take this person back. Sex. Clarity, frenemies, isolation spell. Trying to keep you isolated, restraining order, knowledge, open your eyes, might be a fucking hater. Authorities, manipulation, child, love spell, breakup, come and take con she look it here. Some of you guys, this person has ties in with the authorities. They could have told somebody somebody paid somebody off. Okay, we're not about to go that motherfucking deep. Somebody said that you were the illusionist. You were full of bullshit. You were full of game. Somebody didn't even say you did a motherfucking love spell on them. To have them be this way. But you don't want them. See, this where this shit don't make no motherfucking sense. They ain't got shit to offer you. You don't even want them. You ain't never wanted this person. Like I said, it's not for you to create the life that you live. And this person, the pedo. But they, who, in it for themselves. Are they people letting these people, and they following you. They letting this person get away with this because they probably doing dirty ass work for this person. And they already taken, but I already said that. Child, keep that shit on the low. And they dealing with a Gemini. They got a baby that's not theirs. You're not the father. I just seen that. Yeah, this Gemini doing fraud for this person. Oh, it's an Aries too in here. Aries and a Gemini. This person could be dealing with Aries and a Gemini. And these people gang stalking. You. <laughs> the streets know. Friend of me. They're not your friends. Some of you guys, y'all y'all talking to two, it's, it's two females or there's two, it's two males or two females that have been trying to coerce and talk to you, act like y'all cool, hang out with you. They're dealing with your ex-lover. They're dealing with your ex-lover. Doppelganger copycat, I seen that. Somebody got a doppelganger or a copycat. They could be doppelganging you and copying you. Alright, I'm about to go. This, this shit is crazy. And this person gay. They lying about their sexuality and evidence on it. Because <sighs> you leveling up. And you feel, they feel like you have a lack of support. Alright. I love you guys so much. Take care. They feel like you're an easy target. Mm-mm-mm.